Hello, everyone. And this is part three of Miss Lazar is Bizarre. A visit from Mr. Klutz. When we came back to class, I noticed that this kid named Robbie, who sits in front of me, was missing. Where's Robbie? I asked Miss Daisy. His mother came to pick him up. She said, Robbie wasn't feeling well. That was weird. Robbie never told anyone he was sick. Miss Daisy asked us to clear off our desks and be on our best behavior because Mr. Klutz was coming in to talk with us. Soon, Mr. Klutz came in with his bald head. It is so shiny. He must wax it or something. Mr. Klutz is weird. Hello, second graders, Mr. Klutz said. I came in to tell you about a new program at Ella Mentry School. We're going to become a mean school. That doesn't sound very nice, said Andrea Young. Mean stands for make excellence a necessity, said Mr. Klutz. He wrote mean on the chalkboard and told us that all the parents and teachers and students were going to work really hard so our school would be rated the smartest school in the whole state. Mr. Klutz went on and on about the mean program. I wasn't paying much attention. It was really boring. Finally, Mr. Klutz finished talking, and he asked us if we had any questions. I raised my hand, and he called on me. Does Miss Lazar have superpowers? Uh, no, AJ, Mr. Klutz said. She's just a regular custodian. Regular, asked Ryan. Then how did she climb the wall? That was simple rock climbing, Mr. Klutz said. It's not that difficult. Miss Lazar is cool, some kids said. That's not a question, said Mr. Klutz. Does anyone have any questions? Is the toilet in the boys' bathroom haunted? I asked. You see, my friend Billy around the corner once told me that sometimes a toilet will overflow because there's a ghost inside it pushing the water out. Of course the toilet is not haunted, said Mr. Klutz. Don't be silly. That was cool when Miss Lazar fixed the toilet, Michael said. That's not a question, Michael, said Mr. Klutz. That was cool when Miss Lazar fixed the toilet, wasn't it? Michael asked. Yeah, everybody agreed. Okay, that's enough about Miss Lazar, said Mr. Klutz. Does anyone have any other questions? Mr. Klutz, do you wish you were super custodian instead of being a plain old boring principal? Ryan asked. I have to go now, said Mr. Klutz. The Haunted Toilet Bowl I don't know exactly how it happened, I guess some kid in my class told some kid in another class that the toilet in the boys' bathroom was haunted. That kid told some other kid, and that kid told some other kid. By 2 o'clock, everybody in school was talking about the ghosts in the toilet bowl. None of the boys wanted to go in the boys' room. I wouldn't want to go into a boys' room if there was a ghost in the toilet bowl. Would you? Usually, Miss Daisy lets us go to the boys' room after lunch. But none of us wanted to go in there. I figured I'd wait until I got home. All the boys in school were holding it in all day. We thought we were going to explode. Boys, will you please go to the boys' room, Miss Daisy said. No, all of us boys replied. There's a ghost in the toilet. Then use the girls' room, she said. No way, I said. The girls' room has cooties. None of the boys in the school wanted to go to the boys' room. It must have been another bathroom emergency, because Mr. Klutz called all the boys in the whole school into the gym to talk to us. I promise you the boys' bathroom is not haunted, Mr. Klutz announced. I have been in there. There is no ghost in the toilet. It is perfectly safe to use the bathroom. I don't believe you, some fifth grader yelled. Me neither, said somebody else. I bet Miss Lazar would know if the bathroom is haunted, Ryan said. She knows everything. Yeah, Michael agreed. Everybody started chanting, Miss Lazar, Miss Lazar, Miss Lazar. It was cool. Mr. Klutz called Miss Lazar on his walkie-talkie, and we all cheered when she rode into the gym on her scooter. She had her toilet bowl plunger with her, as usual. This looks like a job for Super Custodian, said Miss Lazar. Is the boys' room haunted, Miss Lazar? asked Mr. Klutz. Of course not, said Miss Lazar. So you killed the ghost that was in the toilet bowl, some first grader asked. There was no ghost in the toilet bowl, Miss Lazar said. Miss Lazar is just being modest, said Ryan. Hooray for Miss Lazar, somebody yelled. She killed the ghost. 
She killed the ghost! Everybody started chanting, She killed the ghost! She killed the ghost! Now we can use the boys' room again, I yelled. Hip hip hooray for Miss Lazar! Everybody shouted. I thought Mr. Klutz would be happy, but he looked like he was all mad about something. One of the fourth graders raised his hand and Mr. Klutz called on him. May I please go to the boys' room? The kid asked. Yes, Mr. Klutz yelled. Go! That's what I've been trying to tell you. Every boy in the school started running for the boys' room like they were giving out free candy in there. It was cool. All right. I hope you're liking the book as much as I am, and I'll see you next time.